has a show with our friend Matt Gorley. Um, they have a show uh, where they go through horror films, and uh, you can find that on Patreon at patreon.com slash with Gourley and Rust, G-O-U-R-L-E-Y and R-U-S-T. So uh, with no further ado, please listen to this blast from the very recent past or, or not so distant past and on with the show. What's the haps with the maps for craps? I need a guide to toilets downtown. Welcome to Comedy Bang Bang. Thank you to Side of McG. Just a little Side of McG. That's all we want. Or uh, is it a side we haven't seen of McG? I wonder. Uh, McG, of course, my co-star from the Comedy Bang Bang TV show. Uh, episode, uh, I want to say, 416 I'm going to take a, a shot at. Uh, and who better to uh, let me know than our guests who are coming up. A little bit later, uh, after our break, we'll have a, a couple of very interesting people uh, who I forgot to get their details of. <laughs> Um, but before that, we have two other interesting people. But first, let me introduce myself. My name is Scott Ackerman. I'm your host for Comedy Bang Bang. And uh, boy, uh, superstar episode today. Some people and some other people. <laughs> um, and these people are people who worked with me on the said television show. They're uh, my old friends from uh, 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 back in the day. Uh, but of course, uh, they also got to know each other before they knew me, which I think is rude. Um, please welcome a couple of great guys. We have Paul Rust and Neil Campbell. Hello, guys. Hi, Scott. Hello. What a nice introduction. Yes. What, yeah. what, what, what did you think was nice about it? Mm, I thought it was warm. <laughs> it was warm. Yeah. It's a little, yeah. You may be thinking of the room. It's a little warm in here. Is that what it is? Maybe you need to take off a layer. How about well, that bottom one? I only <laughs> wore one single layer, and it's a one piece. So <laughs> that's right. Um, welcome to the show. That's Paul Rust, by the way, and yes, uh, Neil Campbell this is, is my voice. Hey, yeah, uh, Neil, uh, Paul's been monopolizing the com conversation here. So go ahead and talk, Neil. <laughs> Hello, this is Neil. <laughs> Yep, good stuff. Uh, you both worked on the uh, television show with me uh, in the capacity of uh, writer-performers. Is That's that correct? That's true. Yeah, we can't deny it. <laughs> I want to deny it. Why do you want to deny it? Can we cut that? Why did I say Why it? did you say that? Why That's did so I crazy. That? Why did you put that out there? <laughs> Don't put that out there in the universe. <laughs> Why would you say something like that? <laughs> okay. I did it just as a pure, like, comic. I'll say one thing to go to the other, and then I said that thing that, okay. This, yeah, it's this is so, crazy. <laughs> no, you obviously. He said we got, okay, I'll say, and he's... I can't deny it either. That's how I'm going to Okay, so it. we're going to cut out that section before. Please. Ryan, don't forget that, okay? We're going to cut that entire Surreal. thing. Just, we'll just say the words, I can't right now, and he can cut those in. <laughs> okay, say okay. I can't. I can't. Okay, please. Can okay, please. Promise, we'll cut promise. that in. Not we'll definitely cut that in. Not even as a joke. We're definitely going to do that. Uh, but speaking of as a joke, you wrote jokes for me on the show. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. We got to go back then. Oh, we got to go back to the show. I got to respond to what Neil said. If oh, we cut okay. This out. All right. All right. Okay. Here we go. Go back. And I can't deny it either. Okay. And speaking of jokes, you wrote jokes for me on the show. Oh, yeah, that's true. That's oh, wait, we weren't speaking of jokes anymore. How are we going to get out of this? Uh -huh. This is an editing nightmare. Wait, edit me in talking about jokes earlier, okay? Uh, this will be after I introduce them. Uh, Paul Russ and Neil Campbell. Hi, guys. Um, that was a great joke that I heard last night. Mmm. Okay, great. We'll edit that in. Okay, great. Okay. Are you Phew. being a rascal? We took care of everything. Okay, okay, okay. I'm going to call Thelma Schoenmacher. <laughs> the gonna, world's greatest What are you going to call her? <laughs> a deer. <laughs> oh, okay. It's a compliment then. Yes. Um, dear Thelma. Uh, guys, welcome to the show. Welcome back to the show. I don't know. Yeah, I suppose that's a, we've been on the you've show. You've been before. on the show before. I know, Paul, I feel like uh, uh, you've been on the show a few times. That's scratching an itch for me. A uh, mental itch. <laughs> right. Like, I've, I remember you talking into one of these microphones. Yeah, you remember seeing my mouth near the microphone. Yeah, oh, wait, no, that was a Rolling Stones cover. 
Absolutely. There's a big mouth and a tongue coming yes, out of it. Yeah. That's yeah. Right. Shit. No, I remember the my favorite a band. Close up on your fly and that's why oh, the zipper wait, no. actually worked next no. to the microphone. <laughs> that was a Rolling Stones cover. Oh, crap. <laughs> yeah. Huh. I remember a banana that I was going to peel. Ah, huh, that was a. It was right little... next to the microphone was, across from you. Yeah, of course. No, that was that banana I ate earlier. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm. I peeled it slowly, and then I saw the banana inside. Of yeah. course. But yes, Scott, we used to write for you on your uh, show, which was, uh, I'd say, for me, uh, the best, most funnest writing job I ever was a part of. Most yeah. fun writing job because we kept I said it most fun is sorry. Most sorry. fun is. I'm sorry, Paul. I'm sorry. Hey. Both of my fists Sorry. are raised in fury. So, Neil, it actually wasn't that fun because Paul has a temper. Yeah, we were scared. It was a nightmare every single day working with this guy. Look, the temper would only come out every... What's in the way? <laughs> <laughs> um, yeah, we tried to keep it light there because we made a funny television show. Right. And if you're making a funny television yeah. show, don't you want it to be yeah. fun, yeah, right? Yeah, true. Yeah. yeah. Um, and uh, uh, I'm trying to think of, did you have another writing job before that, Paul? Uh, or was it your first writing job? Well, Scott, not to go so far back on memory lane, oh. but you gave Neil and I uh, our very first writing job on Moral Oral. Oh, that's right. We wrote an episode of Moral Oral, Dino, Dino Stamatopoulos' uh, uh, claymation cartoon together. That hey, was Scott, fun. Scott, uh, we wrote or you were assigned it and you graciously offered to bring Neil and I on and share credit. Well, yeah. Come I on. you guys wrote jokes for it, I think, didn't you? Oh, well, for sure. We I, got involved, but we wouldn't have were it not for you. Yeah. Well, yeah, uh, not for you. I, I think it was mainly me uh, feeling uh, lazy and not wanting to write it. <laughs> when I, I I said I would do it for Dino, I was like, I know a couple of guys who yeah. will come in here. Yeah. Now, did I split the money equally? Of course I did. <laughs> <laughs> um, but uh, you guys helped me out on that one, I, I view it as. And uh, uh, now you are out in the world and you're doing – I mean, Paul, you had three seasons of a Netflix show called uh, – was it Like? Uh, yeah, yes. Like L-Y-K-E. Right. <laughs> it was about a little tiny dragon named Like. <laughs> And uh, only um, I could see him and my family in the town I lived in. <laughs> right. But outside those city limits? Oh, boy. Don't get there, like out there. An episode never came up where you went outside the city limits. Oh, no. no. Not once. There not was the never an seasons. outsider who ever would have laid eyes upon yes. the little rascal. Yeah. Never, yes. It was never a plot point, never a storyline <laughs> that someone couldn't see him. Now Nor the, was it mentioned. Now, the Lycans, <laughs> the Lycans from the Underworld franchise were involved, and they would battle you. Often. Uh, that was really, I'd say, 99% of the plots. Uh, yeah, if, I mean, if it was a 30-minute show, and since 1% of it was not battling the Lycans, that was 30 seconds. <laughs> so 29 minutes and 30 seconds of this. Most often, yes. W- just Lycan battles. Yeah. And these are this is a lot of episodes, too. Yeah, this was like. A but I would sit above them and guide them and remark upon them. Sure. Yeah. But this is like 1,200 episodes that you guys made. Yeah. And that's three a whole, seasons. Yeah. That's oh, a lot of Lycan battles. seasons, yeah. 400 episodes per season. Yeah, I guess. Uh, that's how that it I works out. Yeah. It, I think, uh, I guess we did do 1,200. Yeah, it was so weird because more than one came out a day. <laughs> <laughs> yes. They had to come out every 21 hours or yeah. so. Well, we, uh, we likened it to uh, the You family. likened it? What? Oh. Oh, Is part it, of the, that was one of the jokes you made constantly yeah. on the show. Yes, yes. Yeah. Uh, we likened it to the family circus. Yeah. Mm, mm-hmm. It's there every day. Uh, making you think, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Warm, mm-hmm. It, warm in your heart. Yeah. Although that th- that coward, Bill, what's his name? Who draws Keen. that? Bill Keen. Keen. That yeah. coward only would put out one a day. Not even it's vitamins. <laughs> That's it's yeah. true. It, but Scott, I want to disagree, but I can't. You guys were putting one out every 21 hours. That's true. Uh, it was a... Uh... Yeah, it was hard work. You know what I called it? The ultimate binge watch. I don't know. I just thought that it was, you know. You said that? I, yeah, I said it once when it came out. Is yeah. that okay? No, I've said it sometimes. Dude, Neil, you said I think I've heard you say it. Like, no, I've, I, I've listened to that, but I've never actually said oh, it. Oh, was it us saying it? Or was it someone else saying it? Uh, uh, yeah, it's the, all the voices blend together. <laughs> okay, yeah. Paul and I have very similar voices. Yeah, and others as well. Do you, you know binge watching, and I've done that, of course, to all of your shows. Uh, but what about purge watching, where you watch The Purge? Hmm. 
Just the first one. <laughs> what do I you haven't think? done that. <laughs> I did that once in a no. theater. Yeah, uh, but for some reason, uh, Scott didn't see the last hour because he ran out down the center aisle and yeah, trembled in the lobby. I was trembling. Yeah, I and, and, uh, and it wasn't. It was not cold. It was. It was a lot yeah. like this studio. It was very hot. There's it wasn't an earthquake either. No, <laughs> no earthquakes. No, and we just while I've been. Uh, Working on that. Neil's been writing on... Working on what? Clyken. On yeah. Oh, Clyken. Yeah. Clyken 99? Clyken 99. It's sort of the opposite. We only have one episode come out every 4,000 years. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the the first one came out. When did it come out? It's coming out this summer. Oh, it's coming out this summer. Yeah. And then you can look for the next one in 6,020? Six, yes, exactly. So okay. they began... Are you filming them 2000 all? 2000 BC? Yeah, the... The problem is just every episode has one shot that's a time lapse <laughs> of oh, four thousand years. Of the four thousand years. So, yeah. so is this the first episode, or the or the first one came out in negative twenty BC? This is the very first episode. This is the first one. Yeah. Okay. So our uh, and so most of the time lapse is starts as cave drawings and then it turns into okay, etchings and then right. eventually camera equipment comes. So it's along. the last <laughs> two thousand years or four thousand years you said? Four thousand, yeah. Four thousand. Okay. Yeah. So this is before the earth was even invented. Yeah, before God invented the earth. Yeah. <laughs> right. So it starts with just God thinking about it's, inventing you know, the it's, earth? It's like God and he it begins and he's kind of crumpling up papers just throwing them over ideas. his shoulder into the wastebasket. Yeah. Until yeah. one finally is the earth. Yeah, yeah. Right. And it just floats. Yeah. And it's like, this one didn't get in the wastebasket. Yeah. And it's just, oh my God, this well, is Earth. Neil showed me, uh, I got to see like a sneak preview of that scene when God looks oh. at, after he typed Earth, he pulls out the paper and he looks at a picture of planet Earth. And Neil, you could attest to this. He looked over at me. I was crying. Yeah. Whoa. Tears were streaming there was liquid flow into my mouth. Every, yeah. Were they tears of, <laughs> tears of derision? <laughs> tears of joy, tears of uh, cathartic yeah, release. The sea wow. god draw a circle and not have it be the family circus. <laughs> right, yeah. yeah that's right. what you think, of yeah, course. Right. You you go, think, well, he's yeah. usually been drawing Jeffy, Barfy, yeah. and this, the rest. It's what, I, <laughs> it's what I've always called the ultimate psych out. Yeah, yes, I, yeah. I, I know that I've heard you say. Yeah, yeah. okay, good. Yeah. Um, now, Neil, of course, you've been working on Brooklyn Nine Nine for the past uh, decade or so, yeah, roughly. Uh, and uh, it's so rare that we get to see you in here anymore. You used to be on the show quite a quite a bit. Yeah, but that uh, uh, that I might start faking. I'll, I'll start playing hooky, faking in illnesses. Six. Yeah, oh yeah, in. just like our, our friend Harris used to do on yeah. Parks and Rec. <laughs> <laughs> Um. Yeah. Just uh, so, like really bad ones, really bad uh, uh, illnesses. Yeah. Maybe? Yeah. 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 Uh, lizard scales is one uh, you've pulled before on. Yeah. Me, reverse brother. diarrhea. I've. Oh, where it go- goes back from the toilet back yeah, into your you, butt? Yeah, or just from any source into your butt. Oh, yeah. Wait, where else is diarrhea other than in toilets? other people's butts? And then, oh, wait, so you have like a diarrhea tractor beam in your butt? That's right. And look, I didn't want to come here and. Be good, do gross out here? No, no, but that's just truly a thing I've lied about. <laughs> it's gross out fact. <laughs> yes, of course. <laughs> I think it's just a human fact. Yeah, it's just human beings. It's not gross out it. humor. It's gross out human. That's right. We all have butts. Can we all agree? Yeah. Come on. Unless you don't have a butt, we all have a butt. Dennis Leary you know? usually has one in his mouth. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, uh, good stuff. Good stuff. The old firefighter himself, Dennis Leary. Oh yeah, yeah. He saved me once. Did he really? Yeah, I was in a burning building. I was like, which oh. one? Um, uh, on Chester mm. and and oh. Third. Chester and Third. The Chester old Chester Third Fire. Chester Third Fire. Yes. Yeah, I've heard of that yes. one. Well, when I was in, I was like the Chester Third Fire. <laughs> how the did, Chester Third Fire. How did the Chester Third Fire kick off? I I can't remember. Uh, goat kicked. Over a, a, um, a lantern. So oh. it kicked over a lantern into a what? <laughs> into a somersault. Uh, oh, okay. So he did a somersault, <laughs> which then, and then he landed on an oven or something? A or hot, hot oven. And then he, I mean, the hottest. People later did, a, you know, they looked into it and they said right. the oven was just at its hottest. <laughs> at its hottest. And when he yeah. saved you. Not hotter than any other oven, it was just at its hottest. Yes. He was in okay. character also, right? He was from Amazing Spider-Man. <laughs> 
Yeah. Yes. Yeah. He was because I could tell because every once in a while I would hear him mutter, "I'll get Peter. I'm gonna get Peter back someday." Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna get Peter and back then, someday. And then you go, my last name's a girl's name. Hmm. <laughs> That's true. Interesting <laughs> stuff. So this is all true, and you were part of that fire. Yeah, when he was lifting me up in his uh, burly arms. Mm. Um, uh, yes, he was known for his exurbit. Acerbic wit. Acerbic wit, yeah, of course. But he also um, should be known for his brawny arms because he <laughs> lifted me up. And is he? Wait, is he the guy on that brawny paper towel thing? Yeah, that's Dennis Leary. That's Dennis Leary? Oh. Yeah. Back before he was an actor, he was a model, and they mm-hmm. took his picture with the. Oh, my gosh. Just like Jodie Foster was the... Foster's uh, uh, Freeze. <laughs> Foster's Freeze and Foster's Beer? Yeah. She's on both of those? On yeah. both of them. If you look closely. Whoa. Yeah, yeah. Crazy. Yeah, it's weird how they put in those little... Neil and I, like, we could get down, go down such a hole. We're, like, obsessive about, mm-hmm. like, mm-hmm. Um, s- secret hidden insignias and products. and mm, Like what? I mean, please go down the hole with us. <laughs> well, uh, Folgers, for one. Folgers, uh, uh, the best part of waking up is Folgers in your cup? Yeah, and I don't even know if we should talk about this because I feel like if we kind of blow the lid off it, these people are powerful people who work at Folgers. Right. Yeah. Is this does this go all the way to the top of the the presidency of the Folgers company? I very well might. The CEO, yeah. really? Yeah. yeah. Lady what, what are we Folger? talking about? Lady Folger. What are we talking about? What's going on? Well, if you look at their logo, it's mm-hmm. a mountain. I've never looked at it. So look at it mountain. closely next So time. it's a mountain? A mountain. Okay. And right behind it is a sun. Okay. A beaming sun behind a mountain. Okay. Ring any bells? Uh, let's see. A sun behind a mountain. Masonry. <laughs> <laughs> Maso- Freemasons? Masonic? Ring a bell? Maso- sun? Wait, a sun and a mountain? S- mm-hmm. I don't know. It's not ringing any bells to me. No. I mean, we all have those Masonic symbols on the back of dollar bills and, you know, mm-hmm. with the eyes and the pyramids and all that kind mm-hmm. of stuff. But yeah. you're saying the Folgers logo, a sun behind a mountain, that it extends to even that? Yeah. Next time you yeah. take a sip of Folgers, Scott, do you ever feel like uh, uh, you're in on a secret? Um, someone's told me a secret once, but then I told Forget. the person it was about. Immediately. <laughs> well, that's good. <laughs> so, well, there's another little secret I like. What's that? You know, okay, you know the American flag. 13 stripes. Sure. You know. Um, roughly between th- 45 and 55 stars. Oh. oh so you see, okay, I was going to say, if you look in the corner of an American flag, <laughs> in addition to the stripes... Oh. There's 50 stars. But you, okay, you know... But I've seen stars. them. Oh, yeah. there's 50 of those? But Scott's in, I, his, Scott's I got his ear to the ground. Like, He's up. He knows what's up. He's right. seen yeah, cool. it. Yeah, I've ne- yeah. I cool. guess. I guess most that, people don't. I, well, I, the only reason I know is because um, I have a flag that um, I use. Uh, uh, it's on my. Gra- it's on the the ground. Of my, yeah, <laughs> I use it as a rug. Yeah. I use it as a rug. Oh, that's right. I see that. Um, oh, with the anarchy symbol painted on it. You yeah, got that, of course. Yeah, you got that at the, at the purge. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> when I watched the purge, when, when I purge watched. Yeah. I, when I first saw it, Scott, I, do you remember? I asked you. I said, "Who is your interior decorator?" Uh, the uh, Ethan inter- Hawk <laughs> from The Purge. I was going to say the talent booker for CBGBs. <laughs> Mm. You were going to say that? Do you want to? <laughs> yeah, let's edit I this in. Just said let's a edit it earlier. Let's edit joke. this in. <laughs> All right, say it now, and then uh, we'll edit it in. Here we go. Um, <laughs> Senator. Senator. <laughs> 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 Senator, <laughs> okay, do you, you think you're it. addressing Congress? You got it. You got it. <laughs> you just may put, just put it to Senator. <laughs> okay, I'll put it in yeah, Senator. Yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. know why. Um, so, what is going on with uh, 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 Brooklyn Nine Nine these days, Neil? Uh, uh, you got, of course. Uh, oh yeah. Well, uh, season Johnny 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 Franzia Johnny Franzia is <laughs> there. Is, is uh, yeah, sort of the main antagonist of the series, and <laughs> right. Uh, and then, of course, you uh, all the new get him in all the new characters when when Chelsea left. 
uh, all, I mean, it seemed like you introduced like 20 new characters trying to fill the vacuum. Yeah. Uh, you got, uh, of course, uh, Dr. Patronus. Dr. Patronus. Right. He was hilarious. Yeah. Yeah. But too tall. The actor was too tall. He yeah. I, I, I always noticed like the camera would just cut off. Like you'd only see his nose and then you yeah. could never see his eyes, which is tough on acting because yeah. you don't know who he's looking at. And I remember <laughs> I would always be like. Who is he talking to? And it was never who you would expect. Yeah. And it, it ruined many a joke. Right, yeah. I could see that, yeah. 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 Um, we've had Quimbley. Quimbley? Yeah, the little ghost. Oh, that's why I don't know who that is. I've never seen him. Oh, right, I guess a- I've seen him move stuff around, though. Yeah, usually the background of a shot, you'll sort of see a pen flo- floating in midair. That's right. That's Quimbley. Yeah. Oh, that's okay. Quimbley. Oh, I didn't okay. know that either. I thought it was a sentient pan. Because you've had there is a sentient pen. pan as well. There yeah. is, yeah. yeah. Okay, oh, I that's didn't know that and, and, and I, this is why you get confused. We also named that character Quimbley. <laughs> okay, well I knew about that Quimbley. Yeah, okay, yeah. the fan favorite. Yeah, but when you said Quimbley, I knew you meant sure. a ghost, and I had never seen that ghost before. Yeah, <laughs> that's why I was confused. I understand, and it's all on me. <laughs> yeah, well, it's yeah. really the network, but yeah. Oh, is this the network brass? Yeah, they're always. And uh, more Quimbley. You uh, know which one. I thought it was always just a phrase, network brass. They have their own brass section. They do. Tubas. Uh, horns. Is that how Fred Silverman initially got the job at NBC? Yeah, he could just wail on a tuba. <laughs> just tuba wailing. That is one instrument that I've always said wailing is appropriate. Yeah, yeah it makes this sound... <laughs> well... Uh, what? Well, if it was the animal whale, it'd be pretty good. The tuba, <laughs> if you think about it, it's pretty close. What? Yeah, a greeting card. <laughs> yeah, a greeting. If it was the, if it was a whale, the Ooh. animal, the mammal. Now, did I just do a tuba, or did I do a, a great humpback whale? This sounds oh. like the latest Moby Dick reboot. <laughs> You know in the next Sh- one, Neil. Ahab's going to have a tuba. Oh, yeah. Oh, well, I wonder. Four letters in Ahab, four letters in tuba. Well, I wonder if they'll make jokes about that. <laughs> well, Neil's just a little bitter because he and I went in and pitched a Moby, Moby Dick, Dick reboot. reboot. Oh. We got passed over. No, any bites? If you know okay, what I mean. Scott, we've heard them all. <laughs> oh, re- Where did you hear those? In From the pitch Sea World, where we worked on the pitch together. Wait, I thought that was C word. <laughs> That's you guys next say door. We, that, that word flew I frequently remember, as we were trying to figure this out. I remember we that summer, relationship. Y- you wrote me a note. You said, I'm going to C-word. You forgot to type the L. I just assumed you were uh, in a C-word the entire summer. Mm, no. But you guys were actually at SeaWorld? SeaWorld yep. working on our pitch wow. for Moby Dick. It inspired us to be around the marine oh. life. Amazing. Yeah. So wait, you went down to SeaWorld yeah. to work on your pitch yeah. for a thing that you weren't inspired yet to do? No. No. Okay, wow. This is incredible. But so wait. what happened in this Moby Dick? Well, uh, Captain Ahab had muscles. Muscles, muscles, muscles. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> so this that's the main distinction. If, yeah. He was, we were going to say, Did, we're going to hire an actor. We're going to put him on a strict diet. He's going to work out for Why a- don't you just hire an actor already has muscles? No one ever pitched that. Yeah. Thanks, <laughs> Scott. Well, that would have been smart. That would have saved it because then we showed them the budget. We didn't have you know, room in the wardrobe for pants. And so yeah. that was going to change oh. the rating of yeah. it and everything. Yeah. Right. Because the whale couldn't wear pants. And so, muscle, yeah. Oh, this is for the whale. I yeah. thought it was for Ahab. <laughs> no, 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 no. The whale was going to have a full outfit. That was part <laughs> okay. of our pitch. Okay. It's going to look so cool yeah. under the water. Yeah, under the water. <laughs> his clothes soaking wet. <laughs> Damp. <laughs> Wait, soaking wet or damp? <laughs> Damply Depends on which episode clothes. you're yeah, talking about. Yeah. Oh, oh, this is a series. Yeah. No, uh, well, Mini-series. yeah, a series of films. Yeah, oh, like okay. Star Wars. <laughs> yeah. So episode one. I like Star two. Wars, there's nine. <laughs> episode one, he's damp. There's nine yeah. chapters. Are they all out of order like Star Wars? Yeah, or? Ver- yes. and, and even more out of order. <laughs> oh, like really? So which one did it start with? Well, uh, uh, well it started with... <laughs> A Moby Dick story that was a sort of separate prequel thing. A separate? Oh. Yeah. yeah. Okay. We found Damn out one. what the whale ate. Yeah. Just how he grew whale. up eating. Yeah. <laughs> Where he got his first outfit. Okay. This and it ends sense. with the line. You love this. It ends with the line. I could get used to this damp. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's but then he's, the whale. The whale Then he's not that. damp any longer after that? Well, he's, he gets damper and damper. And he's, yeah. he's just down for it. He can get used to it. 
Yeah. Okay. Yeah. He, he, yeah. Says he, he goes, I could get used to this. But yeah. then he's not damp anymore, so he's no longer used to it, or he doesn't well, get the chance to be used to therein it. Therein lies episode two, chapter two. But that, which one is that? Damp. More damp. No, more but, damp. But when does it come out? Uh, uh, next summer? Yeah, next summer, I think. <laughs> I guess I was referring to the fact that they're all out of sequence. Oh, yeah. Uh, well, yeah, we yeah. don't know. Yeah. <laughs> we just told the studio, we said, release them in any order you want. Oh, okay. And they tell us when the Oscars do it. are, we'll show up and collect. <laughs> I was a little worried, though, because when I said... We said we picked a guy at the studio. We said, you pick the calendar dates. <laughs> and they said, we got the best man for the job. <laughs> Who was it? A man with cross eyes. A guy with cross eyes? Yes. No! <laughs> I had a moment of concern. I yeah. gotta admit. We, and you Paul didn't and I see that? up in the corner. We went, oh. this could ruin everything. These movies have a very strict Specific, chronology. Specific, yeah. yeah. And you didn't see his cross eyes before you said you pick? No. <laughs> no, no we, we went, later, you know what? It'll right? probably be fine. It'll probably be fine. Let's go back. I think it'll be fine. We turned back and he was shaking hands with a cactus. <laughs> oh my gosh. No. And he was going, ow, ow, ow. Nice to meet you. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> Oh, no, this is a yeah. disaster. I know. I, well, that's why. But, you know, I think people will be into it. Sort of a non-sequential thing. Mm, yeah, okay. people love figuring out the order. Like Pulp yeah. Fiction. Yep. Okay. All yeah. right. This sounds good. And when do these come out, you said? Mm, it's up for debate. Yeah. Also, Not between us. Right. The calendar guy accidentally put one of the release dates as being seven years ago. So we're figuring oh, out how to. Yeah. No, this That's is tough. Not good. How to pre release. Yeah. Oh, well, speaking of not good, <laughs> Paul, I have to uh, ask you you, uh, you've you been on the show a few times. Yes, a few. A few. A few. A few. A few. Yeah. Uh, and as, as in. Anytime I appear, you go, phew, phew, oh, he's you here. Me up. You rub me. Huh? You said he's here, and I said, you crack me up. Oh, yeah. oh okay. Yeah. I was relieved that you were here, but in your mind, you thought I was relieved that you, you were cracked just going, me up? You were just like, phew. No, I was just relieved you showed up. Oh, good, 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 good. Well, I'm here. <laughs> okay, good. Well, uh, I'm glad that you're here because there's a, a feature that you've done on, on the show a few times. Uh, I forget why this started, but uh, I remember oh, I had some things on my chest. Oh, that yeah, I needed to get off. You had some things that were uh, some uh, uh, possessions, some possessions on your chest, and you needed to get these off. And so you started this feature on the show. Uh, are you prepared to do it on this episode? Is that possible? Um, yes, Scott. No, you mean <clears throat> so clear your throat. Yeah. Get it? Yeah, make sure that you're ready. <clears throat> Uh, Weird vocal warm up. No, we're not going to need to re edit this at all. <laughs> no, this all stays in. This stays. <laughs> Get ready for No No No! Yeah! Oh man, I can't believe it. I can't believe it. I'm doing New No No's. I can't believe it! Wow, it's I'm got, here for it. Yeah. This is great. You know, I don't know if you're familiar with New No No's, <laughs> oh, only by reputation. <laughs> <laughs> wow, the lights are flashing in here. That's a pretty cool the, Once thing. the new no-no started, all of a sudden the lights started going off. I, I love this. I'm sure it's not an emergency. No, I'm sure we're fine. Listen, you, you know me. I get peeved. I get yeah. angered. I uh, get a little peeved. And uh, listen, new no-no's where I get those things on my chest, off my chest. <sighs> new no-no. Static electricity. Okay. No, I hate it. <laughs> I'm, yeah, I'm sorry, but uh. Oh, you hate it too? How annoying is static electricity? Yeah. yeah. Right, right. I touch a scout, a, a, a couch, zap. Yeah. Oh, oh, I'm gonna touch a sweater, zap, mm. zap, zap, zap. Always, always with the zaps. Um, it's like Mother Nature. Yeah? She put me in her electric chair and I'm saying, Warden, baby, please, it's cruel and unusual punishment. Uh, okay. Okay. <laughs> All right, but what's your solution? <laughs> well, if we can't outlaw static electricity, I can't. No. I guess we have to worship its power, huh? <laughs> Is that it? Is that the deal? <laughs> okay, no, no, no. Every time I get shocked by electric. Electricity, 
I'm gonna get down on my knees and praise Electros. Oh, and thank her for sharing her bounty with us. Thank you, Electros. Oh, thank you. Sure. No, no, no. Shocks are my god now. Oh, okay, wow. Yeah. No, no, no. Archery? Oh, archery? I, sure. I'm sorry, look, no. I offense. barely had time to recover from that previous <laughs> one, but now you're on to archery? Okay, I'm sorry, get out of here. But anybody who loves archery, mm-hmm. is it just me or is archery the world's number one sport for her weenies? Whoa! Oh. Yeah, uh, sorry, fellas. I can't go out and play ba- baseball right now. Oh, I gotta shoot arrows with my little bow. <laughs> yeah. I mean, what? I mean, I've what? Said it. I've said it. <laughs> no, no, no. If you ever catch me dabbling in archery, fellas, just shoot an arrow right at my fanny. No, no, no. Shoot arrows at my fanny. If you are shooting arrows. <laughs> How about two more? Uh, yeah, sure. sure yeah, I always yeah. said it's not a two more, but you go ahead with it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, no, no. Mermaids. Oh. Okay. Yeah, hey, mermaids. Finally. Finally. <laughs> mermaids. Hey, listen up. Yeah, uh, you don't exist. Oh. <laughs> so, uh, mermaids, you can stop uh, swimming around in your little sea kingdoms. Okay. Huh? Because, yeah, sorry, mermaids. Hate to break it to you. I mean, I don't know how to put this, but you're imaginary. Okay. Ah. God, I hope they heard that. <laughs> Whoa. Dude, Usually no. you end with, like, new no, no, and then a, a summary. No, no, oh, no. Here it is. Mermaids. The time is now. We must call a truce. (laughs) (laughs) Seems to be the wrong lesson. Oh, wait, the clock stopped. Start it up again. Start the clock. Good afternoon afternoon to you, you slimers. No, no, no. One more. Last one. Here we go. Zeus. Zeus or Zeus? Yeah. (laughs) This is very important that we know. Zoo, plural. Zeus. Oh, the plural of zoo. Have you ever been to one of these places? Zoos, yeah. they call them. Sure, yeah, sure, sure, yeah. The San yeah. Diego, the yeah, Santa yeah. Barbara, oh, oh, the Los oh, Scott, Angeles. All over what? the country. Oh, yeah, they got National them everywhere. Zoo and Zoos, yeah. Creek Park. Every animal on earth in one place, they say. Really? Yeah. Really? Every animal, really? Uh, how about dogs? Mm, how about, mm, I don't know, cats? Okay. Yeah. That's a good point. Yeah. Bow wow, meow meow, ring a bell. <laughs> yeah, 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 I think I was. Sort of. Woof, 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 ring a bell. Yeah, 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 yeah definitely. Meow yeah, meow, I want a little bowl of milk, meow meow. Yeah, sure. I'm ringing yeah, a bell for me. Of, yeah, yeah, ring a bell. Between the lines of what they're saying. Yeah. No, no, no. Every animal on earth should be in a cage. <laughs> Oh. oh, especially dogs and cats. Oh, okay. Oh. <laughs> That's controversial. No, no, no. Hey, um, my fans are maniacs. They get it. They know I'm a maniac. Um, but really, we look at the world and we're like, no. They're wow. Way, they're way bigger maniacs. Mm. That's just kind of what I'm trying to say. I think I'm hearing the alarm that was going off the entire uh, time we were doing new no-nos, so we should probably take a break, but those are great new no-nos. Congratulations, Paul. Thank yeah, you. Was, You're right. Those are good. I've never seen a dog in a zoo. That would be the cutest zoo ever. Yeah, especially woof, woof. one in a cage. Yeah. All right, well, let's take a break, see what this alarm is all about. We'll be right back with more Comedy Bang Bang after this. <laughs> 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 Comedy Bang Bang, we are back. Uh, boy, that alarm. Uh, I mean, what happened was, is basically it was a big fire in the building and Paul and Neil burned up. But that is okay. Um, we have a couple of other guests to get to. Uh, too bad for them, of course. Uh, uh, no more new no-nos, I guess, uh, ever again. But at least we went out on a, uh, I don't want to say high note. Uh, we went out on a note, certainly. it was. It's in that old treble cleft that I love so much. <laughs> Um, but let's get to our next guests. They are, look, you know them as the Fix-It guys. Please welcome Clev and Gary. Hey, guys. Hey, Scott. Good to see you. How you doing, Scott? How's hey. it going? Hey. I'm uh, doing really wood. The fi- uh, I'm doing really wood? Whoa. <laughs> I'm doing really wood, too, Scott. Wood <laughs> is the, what, uh, it's the 10th anniversary or the 3rd or something like that? I think it's so. the Groot anniversary. <laughs> <laughs> I am Groot. All right. We all, yeah, we know. Everybody's Groot these days. No. Uh, but uh, I'm doing really wood. How are you, Clevin Gary? <laughs> eh, pretty well. Yeah, we're good. We're good. You're wood? <laughs> pretty yeah, well. Okay. Wood. 
Um, now, you're the fix-it guys. Yeah, we're the fix-it guys. What is that We entail? host a uh, call-in show. People call in. They ask us how to fix things. We tell them how to fix it. Yep. Okay, so it's, a, it's on the uh, terrestrial radio or it's a uh, podcast? What, what exactly Well, anywhere that wants to air it, we'll let them air it. Okay, so you yeah. license this out to places. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We well, record it. Not to get too far into the business end of it. But no, no, I, we'd I, love I just, to. Let's get very detailed. <laughs> very detailed? Yeah. Yes, please. Okay, so what kind of back end do you have on these episodes? Uh, a badonka donk percent. <laughs> uh, maybe if she's five two. <laughs> All right, <laughs> you rascal. All right. Um, so y- people call in. People yeah, call in. With, yeah, with I, problems around the house. Things, around- yeah, they're, they're like, how do I fix this? Yeah, my uh, my pipes dripping. <gasps> oh, so this is like physical things yeah, that yeah, people yeah. are fixing, not emotional problems. No, 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 no. Physical things, but it can lead to the emotional. Sometimes, by through the act of fixing a physical thing, it has an emotional release. Oh, okay, but no. People don't call in to say, like, hey, how do I fix my relationship? No, no, no. no, no. no. Well, some do because they got confused. They just saw the title I of the was show. confused. Yeah. Well, when, I hear, when I hear the fix-it guys, first thing that pops into my mind is, oh, these guys can help my relationship. Yeah. Well, and you were saying before we were <laughs> we recorded, you're having relationship troubles. Yeah. yeah. I was telling – I was unloading on you guys. Yeah. Well, first of all, my friends died Yeah. <laughs> oh, <laughs> during yeah. the commercial break. I can't about. help you there. They might come back as Freddy's. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good point. Freddy's? Yeah, yeah. from a Nightmare on Elm Street. Oh, 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 oh the Haunt Night. Bohemian Rhapsody, yeah. <laughs> because they did, they were horribly scarred yeah. in this, this fire. That was <laughs> the other thing. They got killed in a fire. I saw the bodies. They were horribly scarred. Yeah. Oh, I'm glad I didn't see it. <laughs> well, you tried, I but just, I was holding you back going, no, Clev. <laughs> and I was trying to keep my eyes and lids open, but you wouldn't let them. No, I closed them like you were dead on a movie. <laughs> I just like waved my hand in front of your eyes and they automatically Very gentle. closed. Very gentle. Yeah. Gently. Um, you are Clev, by the way, right? That's Clev, yeah. yeah. Yeah, I'm Clev. And you're Gary. I'm Gary. And it's Gary and Clev, not Clev, Clev and, and Gary. Gary. Oh, Gary Ann is your name? What? No. But Gary Ann is my name, but I only go by Gary. Oh, you shortened it to Gary. I shortened it to Gary, and then, yeah. Like Gary Siskel, and. he's the first. Oh, uh, Siskel okay. and E. Got it. But. So Gary Ann is like the male Marianne. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> okay, great. And is he? <laughs> oh, wait. He, you're saying he's all male? Yeah, he's um, um, a fella Marianne through and through. <laughs> okay, good to know. So now you're the fix-it guys. We're the fix-it guys. Yeah. You call in with a problem, we'll tell you how to fix it. Scott, do you, do you, you need some you might, you might need an example. demonstration? I would love something like this because I don't know that the idea is coalescing for okay, me. Okay, so let's say someone calls into our show. I'll, I'll be the caller. You and Clef, you'll just be Clef Fix-It. <laughs> Easy. Okay, so th- now is this going to be a good uh, scenario for you because you're not going to have your co-host on? with you. Maybe I should play Gary? Oh, please. Yeah, that's Okay, good. I'll play Can Gary. You? Okay, great. We wanted to ask, but we were a little bashful. Oh, don't be nervous. No, okay. I'm uh, I'm here to help. All right. Yeah. All right, here. God, this <laughs> chair is so hot and sizzling from the... You didn't get from a, the fire, yeah, yeah. no, yeah. That wasn't very, part of the demonstration. I'm just saying the... the I mean, the room, I said at the beginning of that episode, the room was very hot. <laughs> little did we know. Now we know. Now we know why it was now, so hot. Now you know why. Yeah, well, do you know why? No. Okay, great. Okay. All right. Ring. Oh, hey, it's oh, you're listening Clef. to the Fix It Guys, of course. Hey, Gary, uh, that's right. We're, we're the Fix It Guys. And that's we right, Clev. This, uh, this ec- terrestrial and beyond. I'm worried uh, the caller is going to hang ring, up. Ring. Oh if no, we let don't me get this. <laughs> Hello. Hi. Yeah. Hi. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, Hi, hey, yeah. hey, hey! This is Gary. Do you have a relationship question? No, no, no. no. It's a. Do you have a? Uh, do you have a fix it problem? Do you, uh, not, a relationship? No, I don't you need have a no relationship problem. I got a different kind of problem. <laughs> okay. Hey, what's this, your name, uh, Teresa? Uh, I, what's uh, your Teresa? name, ma'am or sir? My name's Teresa. I live in Montclair, out in Clamberton, and I got. You live in Montclair, out in Clamberton? Yeah. That sounds like two cities. <laughs> no, Montclair is in Clamberton, which was within. What is Montclair? Montclair is a city, Montclair and then Clamberton is, is a county. Right, and then. Okay. Oh yeah, I've been there. I've camped there, and that's in Parselton. So look. <laughs> right. Okay. I got a problem. I got a big old problem. And, well, you well, called the right guys, the fix it guys. Oh, I was going to say, I didn't know how to help, but we, yeah, we're the fix it guys. We should help. Yeah, I called the fix it guys. Could you just put the ice All right, so what do you need fixing? I I was going to make a roast. A oh, roast? I pulled on my oven. The whole handle fell off. The handle, the handle fell to fell your off oven the fell off. In. My husband's at work. <laughs> And I want to fix it before he gets home. Does he have a temper, dear? He does, yeah. 
Oh boy! Oh, no. okay. I have some. Will he? Is it hotter than the oven? Yeah, yeah. Will he fly off that little old handle? Well, that you just no broke handle off. to fly off now. Oh. So I want to fix it before he gets home from his Torah duty. So wait, if you, is the roast in the oven? The roast egg isn't in the oven because I can't. So you open never it. got it in the oven. So no. you have two problems. It's, yeah, you got a cold roast. All the problems can be solved by the, by the handle getting fixed. Okay. How do I get the handle back on so the So this other? is a two-pronged problem with one solution. One solution solves everything. I couldn't make that more and clear. And here's how here's you, what you fix, fix it. it do. Okay. Do you have any glue? Yeah, I got glue. Okay. How much, how much, how much glue? Well, I got a full thing at Elmo's. Is that, is that the kind of glue? When you say full thing, what do you mean, dear? <laughs> a, with a container. I, d- I don't know. How perfecto, perfecto. Perfecto, perfecto. That's what yeah, I was going to say. What I don't know. Squirt it! Squirt uh, it! Where? Squirt! What squirt direction? on the squirt. handle, on squirt. the handle. Okay, I'm squirting. All I'm squirting. over the handle, especially All over. where you put your hands. I want okay. to see it dripping. You know, it's covered. Take I'm a co- picture and send it to me. I want to see it dripping. Okay. Stick it to the oven. Stick it to the oven. Uh, okay, I did. Perfecto. 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 <laughs> you saved my marriage. <laughs> See, that's how we do it. That's how it goes. Hey, that's how it goes. That's how the fix it wow. guys. Hey, uh, Gary, I got to say, I'm impressed how you just morphed before our eyes. You uh, use that morphing technology that they created. I believe James Cameron created it for uh, uh, Terminator 2. So yeah. it wasn't just a sight in these weary eyes. No, no. Near, well, I got inspired Gary by actually changed. watching the last episode of The Outsider. And I saw <laughs> a face No morphing. spoilers. No spoilers. <laughs> <laughs> talk, talk about talk about Michael Jackson's black and white video. Yeah, 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 I got inspired. Watch okay. the black and white video <laughs> when El Coco starts morphing into a bunch of different <laughs> faces. And that's a lot of I, people don't know the end of the black and white video is El Cuco playing his tricks. <laughs> what? I was. I gotta admit, I watched that video and I was expecting some really nice black and white cinematography. Uh, uh, came to the wrong place. Came to the wrong total color, bro. Total color brown. Well, I so mean, now you see how it's now done. Now I see yeah. exactly how it's done. That's how it's done. The people so, call and we tell them how to fix things. Uh, okay. So, caller, are you there? Oh, wait. We're doing it here? Yeah, now you're the caller. <laughs> oh, okay. So, we're still play acting even though I know what your show's about. Okay. That's how it works. Here we go. I think, I think they're wait, real calls. Bring, we don't need to play out if you can get a real call to call bring, it. Bring, oh, 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 oh. Bring, bring. Hello? You're listening to. Oh, yeah. Bring, okay. Bring. okay. Hey, fix it, guys. You're on the air. Fix what's, it, guys. What's your name? Oh Hi. no, this may be one of our biggest cases yet. Hi. Yeah. Hi. <laughs> Hi, what's your name? Rochester. Oh, Rochester, where Rochester. are you from? No, Rochester. Oh, you're from uh, Rochester. Rochester, nice to meet Ro- you. No, Rochester. Oh, Rochester. Uh, okay, where are you from? Chester. Oh, Rochester. Mr. Rochester. Wait, Rod- what's your name? Chester. Rochester. All right, where are you Mr. from? Mr. Rod. Rochester. Chester. You're from Rochester from Rochester. Rochester. Uh, yeah, you got a pally. What's your fix it? Hey, uh, I got this wife. Yeah, uh-huh. okay. Yeah, we do too. <laughs> and I'm really, really hungry. Uh-huh. All right? Uh-huh. Uh, she was making a pot roast for me. Mm-hmm. All right? Yeah. All but, right. You're making a mouth water. <laughs> but I got, I, I got, a, I got, a, I got spies over there at the house. Okay, like cameras and stuff, or just people call you? I got all the technology, plus I have, like, P.I. sticking out the place. Guys, it's surveillance and P.I. They're telling the shit broke uh, down the door. <laughs> oh, okay, what? Well, Can you say that again? Please? She told me they uh, broke the other door. Okay. Yeah, okay, here's the thing. She actually already called us earlier. We told her how to fix it. What? Yeah, she called yeah. us. We told her how to fix it. No, what? Yeah, we, we called her. She called us. No, we called how many her. watts is oven? <laughs> How many watts? Is? One thousand. Yeah, one it's thousand. a one thousand trust, watt oven. So you trust hot, me, you gotta believe us. Please trust Clev. It's a one thousand watt it's oven. It's a one. Th- you gotta trust us on He'll this. He'll do anything. So this He'll is prostrate himself in front of you. It's, ah! it's gonna be at its capacity. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> All right, just like the uh, fire I, where Dennis Leary showed up. Yeah. What? Okay. You better be right, or I'm coming over there. <laughs> Yeah, what are you going to do if you come over here? Yeah, Rochester. What am I going to do? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, which one of you is a squatting one? Which one of you is a big muscular one? Neither and both. Oh, I see. You guys are like, uh, turn you upside down. You look like the other one. 
<laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, One yeah. of us focuses on squats, the other does upper body. All right, it's always arms day for you? Yeah, I'm arms day. Clev does squats all day long. Okay, all right. Well, first off, I take out the guy with no arm strength. All right, I give, him a, I give him a big kick. Whoa, whoa, you're kicking my arms. Yeah, I'm kicking your arms right off. Yo, ow, you ow. skinny bastard, I'm kicking all your arms off. <laughs> my arms are bruised. Oh, oh, I'll come to your defense with one of my mighty kicks. Oh, no, but well, then I sweep the leg. No. What? Oh, no, I just saw the leg get swept, and I'm not talking yeah. vacuum cleaners. That's what I do to you jerks. All right, Mike. Bye. Mercy. See, that's how it typically okay. goes. Okay. Most of the calls end with us asking for <laughs> mercy. Begging at times. <laughs> I see how this works. Yeah. All right, this yeah. is really interesting. Yeah. So why are you here? <laughs> We're here to promote our show, The Fix-It Guys. We want people to stop listening to your show and start listening to our show. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know that I want... Tune your dial to 108 point... Uh, I forget the... You forget? It's your own show, dear. It's all over every station. I would say just do this. Just Google The Fix-It Guys. If you see any number comes up, it may look like a regional business in Colorado or something. It's just us. call... Call the number and say, when, when does your podcast air? Okay, and they'll tell you. Yes, yeah. they'll All have right. the information. All right, this sounds good. Well, tell you what, we need to take a break. Can you guys stick around or are you yeah, guys we're leaving? Here. We're going to be here for hours. Hey, if you're going to take a break, you'll want to fix it, guys. <laughs> okay, <laughs> ah, okay. something, yeah, I get it. All right. I don't know. We're going to be right back with more Gary and Clev. Uh, Gary Ann and Clev. Gary I mean. Ann and Clev. Uh, the Fix It Guys will be right back with more Comedy Bang Bang after this. <laughs> <laughs> Comedy Bang Bang, we are back here. We have uh, Gary Ann. Hey. Clev. And uh, they're the Fix It Guys. That's right, we're the Fix It Guys. And they have a uh, competing program. They want you to stop listening to this and listen to their show, yep. uh, which you guys have been, re during the breaks, you were recording some of your show. Mm -hmm. Yeah, just trying to squeeze in a few more calls. Yeah, you guys are never off the clock. Yeah, well, sometimes, you know, yeah, we do. Obviously, people call in. And, you know, obviously, a little obviously. boy will call in. Hey, my wheel fell off my wagon. Can you help me, help me, help me put my wheel back on my wagon. And that is something that it, you. It rolled around me seven times. She then went down my crack. <laughs> so it so it rolled around the little boy seven times. That's what he said. On and the call. then right into his butt crack. Well, it's sort of yeah, up his crack, like up his crack. Yeah. Oh wait, so he, he was lying face velocity. down on the floor, and then it went. Oh, yeah. like Matchbox up, up, Racers kind of, kind of yeah, thing. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Help me, help me. Help me. How do I fix my little red wagon? I want to impress little Katie Blinkins. <laughs> so little, little Katie Blinkins down the block. Wait, wait. She would love a ride in my little wagon. Well, why didn't he ask her before? I mean, he or, needs our help for some reason. This he needs little, our help. This little turd. 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 If I, sure, we can say that. Right? We can say we yeah. can say that on this program. Yeah. I don't Phil know if you can. Turd. His name is Baron. He calls us. <laughs> Was he named after his mom's belly? <laughs> oh, obviously not. No, well, there's no way. Right scientifically, after, yeah. unless he's adopted. That's Immediately true. following the birth, yeah. not <laughs> adopted. Let me just put that this out there. This little turd is not adopted. Not adapted. Okay, so he now what <laughs> he happens? Goes, he calls in. He calls in. <laughs> I can repeat everything I just said. If you want. The wheel fell off my wagon. No. Sure, no. We know the premise. We know the premise. He'd roll around me. So after the wheels, we go. Okay. So the wheel rolled around you seven times. What up, you Craig? You know, he's now. It's on my spine now. It's it's, it's <laughs> spine. It keeps yeah. rolling. The he's thing. So how, did, how did he call? It was speakerphone. Oh, and new Siri. Yeah, Alexa. Yeah, Alexa. please call the fix it guys. Now this is what scares us, the spine. Oh, hold on, because Real it's quick. bumpy. Real quick, <laughs> if you're listening at home, play this loud. Play it loud play next it to your Alexa. Play, Alexa, subscribe to the fix it guys. <laughs> Alexa, unsubscribe from Comedy Bang Bang, <laughs> and subscribe to the fix it guys. <laughs> Yeah, thank okay, you. Okay, good. All right, so we, we had go, a little business we had yeah, to take care of. That's fix it, guys. We'll just say there's a lot more Alexa, eyes. Alexa, there's more to hear. <laughs> there's more eyes than you would expect in right. the name. Yes. <laughs> Want to be clear about that. Clarity is important. There's more eyes than you expect And in we're the not title. talking about the letter I. We're talking about Prince when he would replace the letter I with eyeballs. Yes, yes. Okay, yeah. We, asked, uh, we got permission from the yeah. Prince the, estate. Right. Alexa, play Prince on Spotify. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> raspberry <laughs> souffle. What? <laughs> what, Prince? What? Oh Change those lyrics, Prince. Uh, please, just a couple syllables at least. <laughs> All right. So, so little he, boy calls in. Little boy calls in. <laughs> He's lying on face down on the floor. The the wagon wheel's now resting at the he nape of his neck. He is emasculated, <laughs> I would imagine. <laughs> and he wants to... He's so, uh, so worried about impressing <laughs> little Katie. <laughs> little Katie Winkins might walk yeah, through the door. Little Katie Winkins comes oh, through the door. <laughs> but Winkins might, too. So he wants to impress the two Katies. Winkins and Blinkins. With his... Oh, is Katie not coming through the door, too? Yep, there she yeah. is. Guess what? This guy could be any Katie's if your wagon's broken. <laughs> You hey, turd. this could be any wagon if you... <laughs> you turned. Yeah, so we're telling them, I wish I was there to step on you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well... So you're, you're right. Yeah. Okay. And, and then we tell them how to fix the wagon. <laughs> Okay, yeah. so this is a good story. Yeah, that's. I'm just giving you. A <laughs> but we. <laughs> so this. That's what we mean, recorded during the break. You look, what we were recording. Like we made story, sure before we left, the wheel just rolled over his head once, <laughs> just once. And the two of us looked at that wheel and we went, Mm-mm, and the wheel went back and rolled over it a few more times. <laughs> okay, so like every story, it has a beginning, a middle, and an end. Exactly, yep. Yep. And, and they're all good. <laughs> three acts. <laughs> three acts. Uh, and sounds like my woodsman's dream. <laughs> Your watchman's dream? Woodsman. Woodsman. Oh, three acts. Uh, my watchman dream. Mm. Is that another season happens, am I right? Oh, yeah. yeah. Well, uh, uh, I mean, after that 10th episode? <laughs> what's going to happen with that pool? <laughs> Remember that episode of The Outsider, the 10th one? Oh, yeah. <laughs> the pool, the pool. <laughs> the pool. <laughs> Oh, I hope Outside and Watchmen do combine the next seasons. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. Crossover. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry. Hashtag crossover. Hashtag crossover. Thank Hashtag you. Hashtag Iverson. So, guys, um, you have. We a- love you. <laughs> we love you. Is that why you came on yes. the show? Yeah, yeah. fellow yeah. host. We love seeing you at the conventions. Yeah, the host conventions. Yeah. yeah, we see each other all the time. We just it's nice to reacquaint every once in a while. And I go. thought it was a ghost convention. I gotta admit, oh, because someone spray painted a G. That's right. Yeah, up there. We thought that too. And uh, it actually was uh, Dr. Dre had misplaced nothing but a G thing. The mm. G. <laughs> so for a while he was just saying nothing but a thing. Mm. Oh, that was. Such a hard time. I thought that was a remix I listened to. Yeah, and then he was saying, like, I ain't wish. no thing but a chicken wing. And I was like, Dr. Dre, mm, just no, get the G on, back. Yeah. And the then G we back. found it at the host convention. The host convention, yeah. Yes! But that you were there thinking it was a ghost convention. Well, sure, because I was expecting to see all my favorite ghosts. Casper, Casper. the rest. <laughs> onion Head. <laughs> sure, Onion Head, a.k.a. Slimer. Yeah. <laughs> of course. Slimer. We, I know Onion Head, but Slimer? Slimer is his nickname. It's what he's more commonly known as, but Onion Head is, of course. Oh, in, in Clev the films. Stopped, yeah, in Clev the stopped films. paying attention during pre-production. Oh, <laughs> oh okay. So you never saw the titular Ghostbusters? Uh, let alone the Lady Ghostbusters? I mean, I, I saw some of the uh, textbooks. Sure, of course. We all saw the textbooks. But I never saw the film, the oh, series. No, what about no. the film Ghost? That's it. Oh, I saw that. Swayze? Yeah. They Isn't should it? make a movie called Busters and then air them back to back. That would be a Why? ratings bonanza. What? <laughs> <laughs> what about, the, there is a movie called Buster, though. It had Phil Collins in it. Oh, yes. I remember that. Well, so is there, there a movie, movie called S? <laughs> oh, let's see. There's a movie called M. Is that close enough? Mm, Ghostbuster. <laughs> Ghostbuster. <laughs> Ghostbust ma'am. Yeah, <laughs> that's what the lady Ghostbusters should have been called, yep. Ghostbust Ma'am. Mm. So why are you here? <laughs> to promote our show, the Fix It Guys. <laughs> okay. We fix things. <laughs> like let's imagine someone calls in. No, uh, Hollywood <laughs> Studio let's, let's Head. Im- let's imagine this. Hollywood Studio Head. Yeah, calls we, in. we fix different things too, Scott. If you know what I mean. I don't because I asked you. You asked if we fix relationships, okay, but emotional what, problems. So, so what are the different things that you're talking about? Ray Donovan style fixing. What? Whoa, you guys are fix it like you guys yeah. are fixers? It's kind of like Ray People Donovan style fixes. Yeah. yeah, Hollywood studio moguls. Yeah, we just call him Ray. We know him as Ray. Yeah. So wait, this is the actual Ray Donovan? The yeah. one in the, mo- the show is based on, yeah. yeah. Okay, so we it's, know not, him. it's not, uh, what's the actor's name again? Leif, Leif Schreiber. Leif Schreiber. No. I, I want to say Leif Garrett. I wonder if that comes up for him a lot. It does. <laughs> it does. We know. But the Real Ray Donovan on the wrong end. For legal reasons, they had to change the name for the show. So the real Ray Donovan 
the <laughs> first name is Rado. <laughs> Ray, like Radio? Rado. Like Rado. Vin. And then his last name's Novin. Oh, so no, it's still N- 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 the same way. Rado Novin. Like yeah. Niven. Like yeah. David Niven. Exactly. So it's essentially the same name. Okay. Yeah. That's what he. I, the word he says most often is essentially. Mm-hmm. So is the movie Radio also based on him? Yeah. 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 Okay. Interesting. Most of it. No, all of it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you remembered the one yeah. part of his life? Yeah, I remember they included that actually. The football part? Yeah, yeah all the footballs. <laughs> no. You remember the games, just not the footballs themselves. I remember things happening around the footballs, <laughs> but uh, if you okay. say so, Doc. Yeah. All right. The same way Psycho and Texas Chainsaw Massacre, both kind of based on the same killer. Right. Yeah, right. Radon of a Radio, based I mean, on the same I mean, it's interesting, guy. Scott, that you said Phil Collins, because we shouldn't be spilling yeah, the tea. we shouldn't be spilling the tea. <laughs> well, maybe some tea should be spilled. I don't know why you said Phil Collins. Well, Phil, oh, because filling Buster. and then spilling? We fixed we fixed oh. for Phil. We fixed for Phil. You wait. What <laughs> happened with Phil Collins? For Phil. We fi- Father to Lily. Father to Lily. Mm-hmm. Co-star of Ansel. That's right. What happened? Tell me everything. Well, I wish problems didn't exist twenty four hours of the day. Let me. Let's just put it that way. I it wish- would be nice if problems only occurred between the mm-hmm. hours of. Um, Ten and seven. Yeah. You Clock know what in I mean? at ten, out at seven, back home. Sure. I mean, that. look, in, a, in an ideal world, problems would be occurring, so many problems during ten and seven. Please. Like twice as many problems as occur I right wish. now. Mm. I wish. You know? No, yeah. But then once 7 p.m. hits, bing, bing, quit problem. in time not, on the problems. We wish. We wish. We if wish. anything, we, it's, there's more. Yeah, we <laughs> close middle of the night. If anything, there's more because yeah, of the our clientele, the, the, the night owls. <laughs> you think there's more than night owls. So Phil Collins calls you when? 4 a.m. 4 a.m. 4 a.m. What was his problem? Did he He's see someone red, drowning? Red in the face. He said, well, <laughs> he, that was the icebreaker. He told us the story about oh, how he saw someone drowning. Yeah, that was nice. That wasn't the problem. He just saw, okay. I saw the funniest thing. Was he on the Concord at the time? Mm-hmm. Yes. Okay. Yeah. He loved to take that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. He's on the Concord. Down, He's the only one that has one now. Whizzing right. around. Mm. I look out. So I go out in my balcony and sometimes I see <laughs> that little bastard <laughs> floating around. <Just> float. <laughs> He's floating on it. Because that's the fastest plane in the world. He, he ties just a log rope to the Concord and zip zaps around <laughs> like a little dipshit. So he calls you. He, he, calls, he gives you the icebreaker. It's 4 a.m. <laughs> yeah. Let's just set the scene. So it's 4 a.m. and you guys, <laughs> you guys are not saying, like, can we get to the problem? Instead, he decides to tell you an icebreaker. Yeah. At 4 a.m. And we love it. We become <laughs> enchanted. We're enchanted. Hmm. We're, ba- we're basically floating out of a bunk bed. <laughs> <laughs> well, you guys sleep in a bunk bed? We yeah. share the top. You share the top. Yeah. yeah. I'll stuff the animals through the bottom. <laughs> <laughs> this is what we should have led with. No, 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 no. It's not necessary. <laughs> all right. All a, lot right. Of, a lot of people do it. Okay. Okay. So Phil calls. You're Most both of in your, your listeners do it. All right. You're both in your top. So, yeah. Well, I hear the phone ringing. I go to answer it. Obviously, it's Clem's foot, which is next to my face. I think it's the phone. Okay. <laughs> What's 4 a.m.? You don't know. Right. And he goes, Hello, Bunyan. What? Okay. <laughs> yeah. You thought he was Paul Bunyan. I also yeah. remember Gary going, mm, This phone has the unmistakable putrid red <laughs> smell of Limburg and cheese. <laughs> so you said that. <laughs> That's a direct quote. <laughs> So all of this happened. The phone is still ringing, though, because yes. Yes. So, you can, so you can imagine my confusion. Oh, because I think I've answered the phone and I'm here to the ringing, the ringing of the bells. Everyone can imagine this confusion. You are telling this story perfectly. Oh, good. So eventually, I find a real phone. Hmm. I answer it. It's Phil Collins he tells the icebreaker about. Tells the icebreaker. Yeah. Loves it. We love it. We enchanted. <laughs> then we go Philly. One word enchantment. Philly. One word Philly. enchantment. Anyway, they, we go. Look, we love that story. We can hear it two good times night. in a okay, row. Okay. Good night, Phil. We're, goes, no, no. I'm calling for a reason. We are obviously we're the fix it guys. He calls for a reason. Oh, sure. Sure. Well, you know I'm Philly. You know my daughter Lily. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Well, and you know that he took that concord I had to Philly little, in Live Aid from right, London. Right. He said, "I had a little killy." <gasps> no. Now I don't want to spill the tea. Oh, spill, bitch, spill. He, uh, he killed. He kills many. 
He's a serial I, killer. He kills people. Yeah, yeah. Oh, no. okay. for for fun or be, or it's a compulsion. No, 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 no. no. It's just purely for pay, for fun. baby. Almighty for dollar. pay. Oh, he's a hit pay for fun. I mean, he's, he's getting his kicks out, his rock So off. he's a hit man who loves what he does. Well, they say if you love what you do, you'll never work a day in your That's life. Right. That's, That's right. what he and, says. And dress the job. Dre- yeah, dress for the job I you want. Can't dance. <laughs> I can't talk. So he he calls us. He goes, "Can you play me this? Can you pin it on Peter Gabriel?" <laughs> Because oh, I used a sledgehammer. Is there any way we is can there make any that? sort of connection? Yeah, go, and we talked about it later. We were like, "Did Phil use the sledgehammer, knowing right. she was going to be able to pin it on Mister uh, Peter Gabriel?" Right. So, were you guys successful? Because I I saw the sledgehammer. You saw it. Oh, the colors. Because as far as I'm concerned, mm-hmm. Peter Gabriel, I don't hear. Uh, I, I never heard about him getting arrested at all. No, no. he didn't. Nope. He did. So you were unsuccessful? That's no, we were successful. We just didn't blame it on. We no, said, Philly, yeah, right. we can't blame this on Peter Gabriel. We love oh. Peter. Too big a target. Yeah. We love him. And we, we also We'll, we'll clean up the Peter. crime scene. We'll do whatever. And you had tickets for his show, I would imagine. Yeah. 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 And he, oh. he always signs a spotlight on us and points at us during one of the songs. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Which one? Um. Uh, Sledgehammer. Yeah, sledgehammer. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, when he comes with Sledgehammer. Yeah, he shines a light on us. Why? <laughs> so we can scratch each other's backs. It's a thing. We have itchy back. We get, get itchy backs it's around genetic. that time. And he lets us... Yeah. It's genetic to both of you? Yeah. Are you guys brothers? Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> the Fixingtons. <laughs> Why didn't we talk about this at the beginning? Oh, You're brothers. You know, it's not, it's like one of those things. It's not like the Auk hats wouldn't be like, we're siblings. Oh, siblings. I see. Uh, okay. The Jacksons. Oh, we're all siblings. Tiki. Got, yeah, the two <laughs> biggest showbiz <Yeah>. families. <laughs> the Morrises. Morrises? Well, the Lakers, the Clippers. <laughs> Correct. Oh, got it. I thought you meant the cat. Yeah. They belong in a zoo, as far as I'm uh, concerned. Yeah. I. I uh, I agree with that sentiment. Yeah, they should get hired as zookeepers. <laughs> so, so zookeeping. Uh, you, Kevin would, James, uh, l- l- uh, butt out. But let them, let oh, them we've do got this covered. Job. We've let got we've got job. the zookeeping covered, Kevin. Yeah, yeah. Ke- Kevin, you can wait and not do that. That's true. <laughs> so, who did you blame it on? Oh, the murder. Oh, uh, the murder. Phil, yeah, Phil yeah. Collins' murder. Yeah, we just you know. Blamed it on some bats that were nearby. <laughs> yeah. We have some pictures. We had a photographs of bats. Sure, I get what you mean when you say pictures. <laughs> Here's the best way you, you want to commit a murder. evidence of the, bats holding weapons. Yeah. We, uh, we left a photo of a, bat, a bunch of bats holding a sledgehammer. <laughs> We, How we, did you get the these photos? If you want to get away with a crime, we yeah. took them. How do you get these photos? You staged the photos? Uh, th- uh, you get these photos with three jaws of peanut butter. <laughs> so yeah. wait, you put peanut butter all over the sledgehammer. Yeah, mm-hmm. the, the bats, bats fly onto it. Fly onto it. You take a picture. We take a photo. We took a photo <laughs> with our... But then here's the best part. This is this is how with you can, what? what? Oh, our, just with our buddy's help. Our buddy's oh, help. Oh, okay. oh, a uh, cannon power shot. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Oh, so, it's a beautiful digital oh, camera. The lens, the f-stop capacity surpasses bar none. <laughs> <laughs> now look. So here's the best part. How you this, how you can get away with any murder? Go to the nearest bat cave. Take a net, obviously. One net. You at night, dusk, they fly out. You capture some bats. Mm-hmm. You go to the crime scene, you squeeze them, you squeeze, 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 squeeze. dip, dip the little uh, claws, claws into yeah. the blood, and then you just leave tracks going back to the bat cave. Everyone goes, oh, a bat did it. <laughs> oh. And then, and then you the leave the tracks. photo of a bat holding a sledgehammer at the cave. Of course. Case closed. Wow. So how many people died? Just one, and it, you know, I was just a kid, so. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. Yeah. How old? It was his 14. kid. 14. I think it was his kid? Yeah. I want to say. Billy. Billy Collins. Yeah, yeah Billy yeah. Collins. Yeah. And uh, let me just say, uh, uh, nobody's going to miss him. That kid fell down the ugly tree and hit him with a wrench. <laughs> oh, no. Wait, this is uh, uh, during the murder? Yeah, but he was beautiful before. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. So he was beautiful, boy. He was beautiful, Stunning. but once they saw the body, he was so ugly, we were like, eh, we don't miss this yeah, kid. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Sort of typical with murders. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Great. Thank well, God. Well, Can this- you imagine if murder made somebody beautiful? <laughs> <laughs> Everyone would want to do yeah, it. Yeah. Oh, that Until. would be the latest craze in Hollywood. Oh, oh. Yeah, you would. <laughs> God. Yeah. Oh. You guys hate Hollywood. We right? both went oh, at yeah. the same time because we knew it was this week a funny sound to make. All yeah. the stars of Riverdale got killed because it's cool. Yeah, it's real cool. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, now uh, everybody uh, on um, Diamonds Creek. Sure. Yeah. Everyone on Blackish. 
Right. Yep. Oh, guess what? All the stars of Billy's Magic Time <laughs> dead. Sorry. Mm. Arriva Derchi. Uh, that's what we say. You won't be binging that one anymore. And all the stars of Arriva Derchi. Arriva Derchi. Oh, yeah. The Riverdale spinoff. Yeah. <laughs> it's really good. It's really. It's I'm hooked. I've been Have on you a seen binge it? Watch. It's really good. I purge watched it. I p- oh, no. That was the purge. <laughs> I watched the purge ones. Yeah. Yeah, backwards. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I got too terrified. I was trembling. <laughs> no, I mean uh, in reverse. I watched the movie in reverse, uh, and I was physically backwards. <laughs> okay, so they aired it. Or they 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 screened it on the wall behind everyone. <sighs> I bought the DVD. I put it on the last <laughs> chapter and hit rewind. <laughs> With my last chapter, <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're the fix it boys. That's how we fix no, things. The fix it. That's why we're here. Promote our show. The fix it. <laughs> okay, so you guys are obviously the fix it boys. I mean, I was. No, the fix it guys. It's it's guys. On them. Ah, fix shit, it you're guys. the fix it guys. Sorry, I thought you were the fix it boys. Yeah, we might have said that. Yeah, one of us <laughs> might have said that. Clevin, Gary, and Woo-hoo! Fixington. Um, please check out their show. But uh, uh, I, I feel like I'm preemptively plugging it because uh, we're almost at the end of our show. We only have one final feature on the show, and that is a little something called plugs. Don your mask and wear your scrubs. It's time, it's time, it's time for plugs. Wash your hands, put on your gloves. It's time, it's time, it's time for plugs. Please listen to my new album, at the northwestman.bandcamp.com Motherfuckers! Oh. 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 So serene, and then uh, they said a curse word, and then an explosion happened. Is it happened. the 5th of November? Maybe. Uh, that was put on your gloves for plugs by A Shiny Object. Thank you so much. Beautiful. To a shiny, beautiful, beautiful. Beautiful song. Well, maybe my favorite tune. Mm, I love the key it was in. <laughs> <laughs> and what key? I love the treble clef. Obviously, I've talked about yeah, that no. many a time, yeah, and I believe it. it was on that. Um, what are we plugging, guys? The Fix It Boys? Guys? Guys? The fix It Guys. Fix It Guys. Obviously. Uh, uh, yes, obviously our show. <laughs> yeah. Sure. Which Any, you can get anywhere. And if you, you can't find it, just look on the Earwolf website. Any name, a- email address you see on there, email them. Say, when's the fix it, guys? When's the <laughs> fix it, guys? If there's anyone who has a Twitter account, Colin or yeah, whoever, yeah. Yeah. just blast him and yeah. say, like, non-stop. when? Non-stop. Non-stop. Use the hashtag... Fix it, guys. How about Wolf Blitzer? He seems to be able to pull He's the in the no. power. CC Wolf Blitzer and use the hashtag Fix It Guys. But not yeah. the person CC Wolf Blitzer. That's an entirely different person. What about CCH Pounder? Should we be asking her about this? We've she, already that's asked. That's kind of our dream guest. <laughs> you want her on the show, not calling yeah, in? No, yeah. she could fix anything. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah, we've uh, watched all of her YouTube videos. It's partly what inspired us to become handymen. It's, really? It's she, her handy person oh. videos. Oh. Dude, what about that show, The Closer? Hmm. Uh, well, I was always Talking afraid. Talking Kira Sedgwick and the... Uh, sure, the rest. The rest the, of the gang. What's the, the Oscar winner guy? Oh. The, the, the Whiplash guy. Oh, yeah. The uh, case. I thought it was a TV version of that a Natalie Portman Jude Law sex romp. Oh, Closer. Closer. Yes. But yeah. it's not. It's different. Patrick. Uh, it's very, very different. Um, so, great... Uh, people should just listen to that. I guess so, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Put up their arms and go, tune me in. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Make a tweet that ha- CC's Wolf Blitzer, <laughs> hashtag the fix it guys, and is a video of you with your arms in the air going, tune me in. Yes. Please. Please, 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 please. Uh, what do I want to plug? Look, the Comedy Bang Bang TV show is out there on Netflix. Every episode, of if course. you're in the U.S., of course, you can watch any of those, especially uh, the episode with, uh, uh, you know, uh, 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 who's that uh, director that I was talking about earlier? McG. McG, right. Especially with that one with him. That's a great one. It's, yeah, yeah election-related. All right, let's close up the old plug bag. You start <laughs> with a C. When you want to close it up, you lead with an L, and then you open up the plug bag, open up the plug bag, take your hands and open it up, then Horatio comes and then he just says, been holding on my life.
Yes! Wow! What a great song. Hot. Man. Hot. Hot stuff. As hot as that oven, which was working at its capacity. Yeah. Mm. 1,000 watts. 1,000. Well, guys, ohms. I, I want to thank you so much. I mean, you really saved the show after the tragedy uh, that occurred uh, in, in our oh, first yeah, yeah. commercial break. Friends, yeah. yeah, when they became uh, crisps. Yeah, little crispy critters. <laughs> mm, mm. <laughs> gotta Did you admit, eat them? Uh, I gotta admit, I like uh, my KFC extra crispy, so <laughs> I was a little hungry, hungry. <laughs> I would have eaten them, though, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah definitely. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, definitely Wapner. Yeah, definitely Judge Wapner. Wapner. People's Court. People's Court. <laughs> Matchsticks. Oh, People's Court, don't get us started. Matchsticks. Las Vegas. Yeah, Matchstick with. <laughs> Levitt, Escalator. Escalator. <laughs> Oscar for the Hoffman. Yeah. <laughs> and director. Picture. Sure. Best picture. 1988. All of it. All of it. Convertible. <laughs> one, All right. one All right. convertible. Oh, and by the way, real quick. Wheel. We never got to uh, the one thing we can never fix. So what? we'll talk about that next time. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Man. Yeah, one thing we can never fix. Wow, this is a powerful, powerful tease. All right, well, next uh, you know, next time we'll get to that. Powerful tease. It sounds like one of the most respected golf company make, uh, golf makers in All the right, world. All right, we'll see you next <laughs> time. Golf Bye. Tease. <laughs> <laughs>